to see a community so devastated and now it looks just isolated in this situation but hopefully with the weather they'll have some time to recoup yeah you know there's been so many boots on the ground helping mm -hmm. them out with the recovery process since i mean wednesday that's the first day we had nice weather mm -hmm. but there's still plenty to do so yeah. help your neighbors if you see anybody struggling this is mm -hmm. a good time to just be sensitive and keep a close eye on people who you know might be struggling with either power outages and we could go on for days down trees so much devastation just from those gusty conditions we experienced on wednesday or excuse me tuesday all the way into Tuesday night. Now, let's take a look outside right now. We saw some partly cloudy skies over the city of San Francisco, but it's starting to clear up a little bit. Don't be too alarmed, though. Clouds are going to move in and out all throughout this afternoon. Nothing producing rain, though. The time now is 6.15. At 7.17, we're going to see the official sunrise, and it's going to be gorgeous. As we head into our St. Patrick's afternoon, we're expecting 60s in the forecast, anywhere all the way down into the Santa Clara Valley, or even north up in a wine country. It's Friday. Get out there. Get some fresh air. Check out your local park if you have the opportunity to. Today is also a great day to head to a local museum if you wanted to stay inside for a little bit and still get some fresh air by saying you went out. Once we head into Sunday, that would be a great day to kind of hunker down or maybe just find an opportunity to stay in for a little bit longer in those morning hours because that's when the rain returns. I'll time that out for you right now because it's not too alarming. I know when you see that rain icon at this point, you kind of tremble a little bit, thinking to yourself, oh, how much rain is expected to come? Well, here's the good news. As we take a look at Futurecast, heading all the way into Saturday morning into the afternoon hours, this is now by 5 o'clock. It's just high clouds sweeping in. But once we extend into those late evening hours, early morning hours on Sunday, just by 3.30 all the way into 7, 8 o'clock, notice how that weak band of rain sweeps its way through, and then we kind of just see some drizzly conditions behind that. So good news there. It's nothing too alarming. But hey, if you plan on heading up to the Tahoe area, sunny skies today, partly cloudy skies tomorrow, snow heading into Sunday. We'll have more on that in a bit.